Hi I'm James and in this video I'm taking a look at Grid Autosport running on Intel HD 5500 graphics. As we can see here we are running 1366 by 768 on the medium detail preset and just running the game's built in benchmark where it performs an all AI race um, and a single lap and measures the average frame rate and minimum and maximum as well throughout this. The test doesn't repeat perfectly every time because the AI cars are actually racing against each other, but it does generally give consistent results. Uh, so you can compare to other grid autosport videos I have on this channel as well. Um, overall the game seems to run quite well. We're talking near sort of 30 frames per second uh, average. Um, this again looking quite nice so you've got a fairly similar experience to say if you were playing this game on one of the previous generation consoles like the PlayStation 3 or the Xbox 360. It looks quite pretty, obviously we're missing out on some of the more detailed effects, but if you want to play this on your Broadwell HD 5500 equipped Ultrabook or similar laptop, it shouldn't really be a problem. You won't have the experience you have on a higher end PC obviously, but it's going to be there, it's going to run, it's going to be playable. You can also run uh, 1080p as well if you're willing to drop the detail levels down again. Uh, sort of low detail 1080p should be similar sort of performance to this if you want to play native resolution on a laptop which has one of those 1080p panels. I hope you found this video interesting and be sure to check out the rest of our channel for other HD 5500 and Grid Autosport on uh, other platforms. We've got lots of content on there and if you want to keep in touch with what we do then hit the subscribe button.